2009 is the 400th anniversary of the first use of a telescope for astronomy. It's also the 60th anniversary of the first use of the 200-inch Hale telescope at Palomar Mountain. We have a new observing program here at Palomar where we're using a smaller, wide-angle telescope with a huge camera that surveys the night sky. We beam that data off of Palomar to a computing center in Berkeley. And at Berkeley, they analyze the images, they compare them to old images. It's actually done by computer. The computers then send a signal back to Palomar to one of our other telescopes, a 60-inch telescope, and that automatically will go find these new objects, study them. The ones that they then determine are really interesting, we come back to the big telescope here and we do detailed follow-up observations. These are things we call transients. When I was young, a transient was something different, but for astronomy, a transient is anything that comes and goes in the night sky. So a thing that flares up in brightness, suddenly to appear and fade away, a moving asteroid or something like that would qualify as a transient. If you look at the same big region of the sky every night, every couple of nights, and make rapid comparisons in real time, you can actually catch something as it goes off, as this new thing happens. This new observing program, the Palomar Transient Factory, is looking for these things that come and go in the night sky with a frequency that no one's ever looked before. And we're finding more objects than anyone ever dreamed possible. 